Hello, this is a comparison between a Bersendorfer 170, that's 5 foot 7 inches long, and a Steinway Model M, which is also 170. Both pianos have been restored in great detail. This is the Bersendorf for the keys are perfect ivories. And the Steinway also has perfect ivory keys. The Bersendorf has three pedals. That's the middle one is a, a Sostenuto pedal. The Bersendorf was made in 1916. Steinway was made in 1926. It has two pedals, no Sostenuto. That can be fitted if you would like one when we restore a, a, a grand piano. However, the Sostenuto on older pianos isn't that common and it certainly isn't necessary for any exams. This is a Rosewood Steinway, made in 1925. The restoration on both pianos is very similar. They've been completely redone, soundboard repaired if necessary, refinished, new German strings, the best quality available, and both of them have um, a rock maple, Canadian rock maple rest blank, which is where the tuning pins fit into. This is the Steinway. It's made in Hamburg. It's a German Steinway, and again, um, everything's been uh, restored in greatest detail. Also got a rock maple tuning block. The Bersendorf has got new Arbel hammers and uh, they've been toned throughout including the Unicorda pedal. Um, it's also got new rollers and felts in general. The Steinway's also got correct Steinway hammers for the period of the piano and has also been toned with the Unicorda pedal. An important factor on smaller grand pianos is that there's less leg room, um, there's one inch less leg room on most of them so um, you, we can raise the, that up with a, a glass caster cut which is one inch uh, <coughs> almost exactly um, but then the pedals will also need to be raised up which we, we can also adapt because the pedals end up higher. So let's have a listen to both pianos, here's the Bersendorfer. With the Unicorda pedal it sounds like this. Here's the Steinway. I'll start off with the Unicorda demonstration. So as I push the Unicorda pedal, you can see the keys moving and there'll be a difference in tone. Both pianos have a really warm, rich tone here. The Steinway is a bit lighter touch, the Bosendorf was medium touch. Thank you very much for listening.